Steve Bruce, 34 years old, captain of Manchester United, a servant at Old Trafford since 1987. Renowned for his bravery, his leadership, his organisational skills, his goal scoring at set pieces and of course, his filmmaking. took the old camera again and uh, decided that with uh, 10 games to go and a semi-final coming up it would be nice to try and have a go at the captain's log again. By popular demand I must say, um, I think everybody enjoyed it last time and I think the players enjoyed it as well afterwards, it was something good to look back on. So let's hope it produces the same results and uh, that we go on to win hopefully a third championship and who knows even the elusive double-double. I can't believe this camera's come back again. I love to that. So do you, mate. Get that bleeding camera off me. Where that's it from? You better get the ball. You got a ball. You got a ball. You're a ball. We'll just see what we can do with this. Hello. Alright, mate. <laughs> what are you laughing at? Not as bad as it was. No. Free tickets and two rounds. One eye will keep you. The nice shoes he's pizza. Yeah. Where did he get them from? What was? It's good. Spurs always provide exciting opposition. People are saying this will be a dress rehearsal for the FA Cup final. Tonight though it's all about league points. For me it's all about stopping Messers, Sheringham and Klinsman from scoring. Oh, and Incy and Peter from arguing. It's really all about killing time up the kickoff. All you really want to do is get out there. Everyone prepares in their own way, and of course, Incy is the entertainer. Leeds champions two years ago merely came to spoil it Old Trafford, despite having the clearest chance of a chess-like tactical battle. Chris Fairclough skimming the bar. Then to Liverpool in the season's cruncher. Got away from Ablett. Hughes calling for it. Kick to Riding. One nil. That way, I'm to the rescue. Have no fear. Eat it here. And then, at last, it's game on. Bruce.
Bruce in very strongly on Klinsman. Hughes frees Konchelskis and it's the first attack from United in 30 seconds. That's in the air. Cole's there. Off the post by Hughes. And beautiful ball back to Konchelskis. There's room for a good cross here. Oh, Cole! As Giggs takes the corner. Ince's his header. Super save. This wants to come back to Irwin. That's a great ball in. Giggs is there. Oh, it's gone wide. A goalless draw at this stage of the season feels like a defeat. Only wins will really do to keep the pressure on Blackburn at the top. <coughs> well, it's um, it's sad afternoon and uh, we're clearing off to Liverpool in the, at five o'clock. Um, it's a bit strange that usually, it's only 50 minutes up the waterway, but uh, we always travel to Liverpool the night before because we value it as a, a, crucial, a crucial game to us. It's funny how we don't travel to Everton though, but maybe I'll ask the manager that one, and why we always travel to Liverpool. I think even my United supporters know the reason why anyway. But anyway, the, the wife and kids have cleared off for the weekend anyway, so I'm left on my own. I've had my beans on toast, which I've lived on for the past three days, and uh, let's see how we get on tomorrow at Anfield. Oh, it's Davis the tactician now? <laughs> Why? I don't know what for effect. What you'll do for effect? <laughs> you must put some contract with that. I know. I'll stop. Get this real centre half in here. Real centre half. <laughs> I'll tell you one thing, boy, he'd have tested your bloody patience, that pasta. <laughs> he would have tested your patience. After lunch, it's the short trip to Anfield. But no trip would be complete without the hard-fought game of cards. This is certainly no friendly game, I can tell you. Get this on tight, right? What you There are few more hostile welcomes than at Anfield. I've seen it so many times though now I'm almost oblivious to it. As a professional though, you must treat it like any other game. Liverpool or not, those three points are vital. Ah,
As you call it, the man. What do you want? Oh, he knows everything about him, bro. Come on. Back on. Back on. Hey? Show your face, please, Mr. Fever, to the cameras. Look, there's... Quiet, don't you? Is that right, Norman? Yeah, a bit quiet. Does it look like a face? Does it look like a face? You're a bit quiet today, Dave. I know it's a big one. Norman, look, it's on you. That face is going to die soon. I can remember when you come out. This man's only got two years to live. Norman, look at the camera. This man's only got two years to live. Johnny Ryan over there in the blue shirt. And next thing you've got Alex, the next Alex Ferguson. <laughs> on trophies, year in and year out. And still as modest and honest as anybody I've ever met. <laughs> and as for the white socks, he doesn't get paid well. Say that again. Come on, it's sharp, it's all of us, eh? Come on. Thanks, 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 Thanks. 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 stage for Liverpool, heartbreaking for Manchester United. Oh, no, here's Roy Keane. Here's Roy Keane before the game. The game looked very relaxed, very relaxed indeed. And he's watching, what's he watching? He's watching a bit of old football at the time. Looking very, uh, very cash, as you can see tonight. <laughs> very cash indeed. So obviously we like shopping with Sharpie. <laughs> there's Pete. Well, oh no, we won't have Pete. <laughs> there's a tactician board, look. Four floors. <laughs> <laughs> he's having a game. Uh, there he is. Huh? Near you. Don't know. <laughs> Let me switch over to it's class, Dan. Jaffa cakes. Hand. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, Jaffa cakes and the medical table. Plenty of water and bananas. Mm. High tech. Thursday wear must be a trialist here somewhere. All <laughs> 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 well, the kit nicely spread around the room. Oh, and there's Roy Keane again. <laughs> He's had a nice little short bag inside, isn't it? <laughs> How'd you pause it? Ah, here's the Ukrainian Andre with a nice little haircut round the back. Oh, getting ready for the game, all relaxed. Yeah, yeah. Andre, who, as you can see, doesn't wear insoles on his boots. There's a little trade, trade secret. No insoles. Oh, hard feet, Andre, huh? Hmm. Big Pally relaxing over there, look. Sat nice and cash. Mark Hughes watching some more footage of himself. Give, a, give away a penalty in this one next one. Yes. Oh, yes, 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 I think the intentions the intentions behind it are uh, uh, short at the back and size. I think the top's getting grown, isn't it, Gary? I think that's what we're looking for. Is that yeah, what we're looking for? A heavy on top? Shaggy look, yeah. Yeah, heavy on top, sort oh, of. Yeah. Uh, from the Great Hmm, right. So we have to drag I got one. And you? Not as good as that one. Six bare for you, yeah. anyway. It's good if you got it. Yeah. Yeah. Bad it doesn't last very long. Though. No, it doesn't. It's good though. It's good for uh, make your own soft bond films, but not other films. Remember, wait for your ball. The card is to take the ball and move. Pass and move. <laughs> the Liverpool defeat is now completely forgotten. Victory against Arsenal tonight though is a must. We all know it, you can sense the determination. Come on, come on, come on. Ready? Okay, gotta win it, come on. Ready? 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 Come on, come on. 
Out to Giggs. Pulling Adams across. Good ball in. Bartram can only palm it away. Keown swings a leg. Sharp. Hughes. 1 0. Opened up for Kanchelskis. Winterburn trying to close him in. Hughes. Sharp. Swings a boot. Scores the goal. And it's rock and roll time. Ryan Giggs. Irwin trying to offer an option. Giggs! Saved by Bartram. Cole leaving it. Kanchelskis. 3 0. Point safe. He's played a good standard, I think. You're batting the tour, Alex. You're not batting tonight. Just be easy. Hey, bowling. Are you bowling? Nearly got two out. Oh, you're just bowling. He's going to bowl. I love to watch my kids whenever I can. Family life is so important to me. I couldn't survive without it. Alex is a determined lad with a very strong will. He needs it though. It's not easy when your dad's a Manchester United player, but he's coped very, very well. Another thing about Alex is that he maintains the Bruce tradition of putting everything into whatever he does. Sometimes though, this doesn't please his mother. His trousers were brand new this morning, cost me 30.99 or something. <laughs> You won't need your chops on it spoiling out there. Make sure you got plenty oh, of drinks down there. I'm suspended for this game. Too many bookings, unfortunately. So all I can do is watch and hope. Played by Neville. Sends a more direct approach from Manchester United here. Cole takes it in the stride. McLaren! Another huge throw. Lukic comes. It's corner. Here he comes. Thank goodness for that. There's no one missing. 
when he doesn't drop balls. Late all week. For the past 10 years I've been running my own soccer schools for kids. I've been staggered with the ability and enthusiasm that they've shown. They seem to enjoy it too as the numbers seem to increase in every year. It's a big commitment for 350 happy kids is proof that it's been a worthwhile venture. Okay, it leaves for me just to say a final few words. Uh, firstly to the, to the mums and dads. Um, for your patience and all of this, I know um, I've shoved you to the back of the room and all the rest of it. But as you can see, we did have a few kids. And to the most important, the kids themselves. I think we've only had one or two minor little scuffles, which if you take 350, it's not bad at all. So I thank you on that. Well done, kids. Well done. I like the fan because he's got to shoot because he's got to go to the dentist at quarter past three. <laughs> so I think, no, that is true, by the way. I've dragged him here to start with and he said he would, but uh, he has to go to the dentist at quarter past three because he's going for a night out in Newcastle tomorrow night. So don't tell anybody, will you? <laughs> right? So thanks again to Lee Sharp. Let's hear it for Lee. Missing any match through suspension is annoying, but an FA Cup semi-final feels even more dreadful. The lads seem relaxed enough, but with Spurs losing to Everton in the other semi-final, it proves that the favourites must not be complacent.
không? First of all, you know. You've got a double this, you've got a double yeah, this year. So surprise visit AC. Bit of tap dancing. You can dance, can't you? Of course! Manchester United are in front in the semi-final for the first time and Steve Bruce marks his comeback with a thumping header past Rhys Wilmot. And now Ian Dowry is marking Steve Bruce. Alistair is free and it's two -nil. Two centre backs have really made them pay for some poor defending. Nice is stayed off by Armstrong. Southgate. Well, Roy Keane. One or two Manchester United players, notably Irwin, believing that Southgate made more of that than was necessary. Keane is sent off. Another cup final for us. Another superb team effort. However, we know that Keeney's sending off will grab all the headlines. The media always concentrate on the sensational, and Manchester United are, of course, big news. Keeney's going all right, all right. Mate. It's his five minutes. It's his five minutes. Oops. Don't forget massages on top of tomorrow. Don't forget the massages. You've got your time. Let's have a look at you, then. Is it a mess? No, it's not too bad. How many stitches is that? Ah, just a few. Just a few. <laughs> <laughs> Mike under you. I mean, <laughs> here we go, 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 here
I wish I could watch more of Alex's matches, but it's difficult to find the time during the season. Still, my wife Janet and my daughter Amy are Alex's biggest fans and they turn out to watch him whatever the weather. Anyway. He'll go back and try and play the back four. 
could take the ball off the back forward, try to get it comes from him, try to get a pass from him. And it means that David, you come in and play against Peacock. And if it's into a back four position, Gary, you then make sure you're against him. Because he's quite clever. You know how to pace about him. He's clever enough to, to time his runs well. His timing of runs is really good. <coughs> Too many times they've come here and we'll allow them to get into a pattern. Don't allow them. Be physically aggressive. That's what always will matter in a game of football. The space behind defenders. Make them turn. Make them life difficult for them. Importantly too, Saturday you really enjoyed it. Even in a difficult surface. He's all wanted it. He's all wanted the ball. You all want to play. You all want to pass it and move and pass and move. Brilliant. The second goal was great off the ball running. The chalky and sharpy. Good pass out to him. A good finish. <coughs> okay, enjoy the game. is able to recover. This couldn't take it first time. Gets in the cross, they're queuing at the back, back by Hughes! And it's over the top. Alistair dancing around like a Muhammad Ali. And more! Well, I must say, Jonsson got away with that for me. I suppose looking back on the last few weeks, um, been a bit of a disappointment really I think we've a couple of clubs have done us favours i.e. Manchester City pulled off a great result for them but I think we're the disappointing ones because we've we've had three home games and not managed to score and uh, when you're going for uh, championships you need desperately to win your home games and pick something up from your away games as well so um, we're a little bit disappointed in that but we've we're now with four games to play we're still eight, eight points behind um, but who knows I mean we'll, we'll see what happens Oh, he's got away here, Cole, that was great work, great save, and back in by Skull! Paul Skull is the scorer! Bouncing around dangerously in there, Presley did get a touch to it in fact. Pallister away to Dublin, and in by Unlow! Peter Unlow has scored for Coventry! United one offside, there's no flag! So what's your suspension for? Is it a load of bookings or something? Yeah, I got booked in I against that, who's against? I had a book someone, right? It was. But I thought last year I got booked. And um, I got booked right back, I think, about three weeks from the end of the season. So it did count, you know what I mean? Yeah. They yeah. set a deadline, didn't they? Yeah. <coughs> and I thought I'd say this year, but. It's this guy, mate. Please. Ah! Get the fuck out of the way of the TV, please. Just to the canvas. Oh, Paddy. I'm set away. Come here now. Come here. Okay, I can get my iPad. I'll talk to you soon. Hughes lays it back. But lays it long. Cole is the target. Oh, he's got behind Presley. Here's Andy Cole with a great chance. That's 2-1 to Manchester United. It's Andy Cole, Britain's richest footballer. There we go. Once again, Coventry. Cut out by David May. It's Cook's ball in again. Oh, and a goal. Presley is the scorer. The young Scott. Bad defending that. Really, really bad defending. Hmm. Oh, so, so clear. Twenty-six attempts on goal in all. Fourteen of them on target. Now Cole is in behind again here. Here's Andy Cole. Right? And he said to me, I feel like I'm going to get a couple. And this is what happened. 
He gets a couple. <laughs> he gets a couple. Love to touch that. He's bang. Have some of that. What about touch? This is not on the body. Look. Great touch. I could have missed that. I would have missed that. Great <laughs> touch that is well. It's good. Hey, hey, hey. Come here, flick. X rated. X rated. Hey. Big boy. Come here, look. <laughs> Just while we're in front, some of the boys. Two scored, Andy and you. Sing a song. Sing a song. See it. Thanks for having us, Dan. He's trying to do it now, then you can get off before the 600 children come out. Oh. Which might be better because yeah. once the word gets out, everybody will be here. Yeah. Thanks for coming. No problems. Thank you. It's made my day. I'm going to go back to the children's day. <laughs> <laughs> Did you come here? For, you know, the old school. Man. This is the other secretary. Hello, Robbie. Nice to meet you. Would you like a drink? Like a drink? That's the first one I've done since I've come up here. Is it? Nice to think. Yeah. Well, yeah. Mrs. Tompkins put that on the board. And oh, was it? She thought of it coming to work one morning. She put it on the uh, board. Was it Monday? Tuesday. Tuesday, Tuesday. I'm sorry, Tuesday. Right, come here Tuesday, Brian, then. And uh, some extras. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, So what we'll do now, we've got the trophy, we've got some trophies for the lads as well, and we've got the young man here to present them for your man. And um, so we'll go ahead first over the trophy, the captain come up. Um, and that's the, Tom's on the city school next <laughs> I'd like you all to thank Andy for coming along uh, this, this afternoon. Um, he's came at pretty short notice, so could you give our Andy, Andy a round of applause? Hey, hold on. Hi, hey, chaps. He's not in the Griffin. Chris! <laughs> we can follow the cameraman down the Griffin. As well. Just follow the cameraman. Down to the Griffin. He's going to send a view cam. He sent Sky down to be here to do the running. <laughs> Outside broadcast. Roy King at the Griffin. <laughs> 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 Scholes with another corner. Off the head of Pierce, back to Scholes again. Pass Bright. May! David May this time! Sharp, he spotted Nicky Butt, Hughes, back for Butt again, good try, goalkeeper's lost it! Ingo. People often ask me, especially young ones, what's Ryan Giggs like? Well, here's your own guided tour to his brand new house. This is my relaxing room. You spend a lot of time in here? Yeah, I must. When I come home from training, from reading, I suddenly read the papers, read a book. This 
as well. I don't really spend much of my time in the kitchen. Who makes your meals then? Um, I go round to my friend's house, or my mum's. Um, there's, a, there's a jelly I cooked. Yeah, you made that. Oh, well made, yeah, not cooked. <laughs> no, it's looking fairly healthy. Mm. No beer? Nope. The wine's for cooking meals. These are um, four pictures that um, I've bought at an auction for Brian Robson and Scanner and Veal. Right. And this is mine and um, my friend Stuart's. That's what we did. He had him and I stuck them together. <laughs> <laughs> Another shirt there. What's that one? That's my um, cup final one. Oh, right. Um, as a present off Insee. Um, for my 21st birthday, you can see that. This is my bedroom. Very tidy. Very tidy. <laughs> so how come the whole house, the whole, the whole house is tidy? Do you, are you a bit of a, a domestic? No, my cleaner's been this morning. <laughs> <laughs> so that's why it's tidy. You're so honest. <laughs> <laughs> this is the suits. So I just keep the suits. I've got a dodgy wardrobe in there actually. Where oh, the dodgy. Oh, well, I'll look at the dodgy wardrobe in a minute. <laughs> this is where I just keep all my shoes and this is my dodgy wardrobe. Now we're getting somewhere. <laughs> Locked, I noticed. <laughs> ah, yeah, no, I recognise the black and white stripe thing. <laughs> that was Championship yeah. Day 93, wasn't That's it, right, that yeah. year? Mm -hmm. I've never worn it since. Have you not? No. <laughs> He's alright. He's alright. That's no, my favourite film, Grease. Yeah? One of them, yeah. <laughs> really? Yeah. Go on then, give us a song. No. <laughs> so why Cassie and Ali? Um, after the boxer. Cassie is Clay. Ah, uh -huh. I'm That's where you should have been Alistair. Oh, no, you haven't that. What? The bedside? That's where you should have been. At the bedside? <laughs> what? At the bedside? Yeah. Why has he been born? Yeah. He choked you. He's a little boy, lads. He's got to let you know. Cody, is that a little boy? I think you go on the pitch today before the game, just to shake the crowd up, just to get the crowd going, you go out, yeah, we need them today. Watson saw that the ball was on to the run of Jim Majuk, trying to chip Schmeichel, they've scored. There's a real mess here, and it's going to lead to Andy Cole! Irwin. And here is Cole! Well, blocked by... The oh! He's given a penalty! Paul Danson has given Manchester United a penalty. Irwin against Bessant. Manchester United are in front! I've already kissed two biggins for this club. <laughs> And so we come into the last game of the league season, knowing we could still be champions. A win for us, 
a draw defeat for Blackburn and the title race, supposedly long since over, could be won by us right on the line. It seems a remote possibility, but it seemed even more remote a few weeks ago, and yet, here we are. We'd shown tremendous character to give us this chance, and would Lady Luck be on our side? Oh, the pub this evening? Yeah. Is that this season? Yeah. Good right. shot, pets. Worked really well. Come on, lads. Come on now. Come on, we're going to win, eh? Let's go for it. Yeah, come on. Yeah. Come on, Come on, Come on, Come on, truly describe the feelings of extreme disappointment. To have come so far and to have been so close is the bitterest pill of all. Nine months of toil and it comes down to one goal we did everything to score. One consolation of course was the FA Cup was still to come and our attention soon switched to that. Are you not nervous? Today? Not today, no. Well, At three o'clock, you never know. Are you get nervous, do you? For game play, no, miss, you've been champion and all that. No, I don't get nervous. Excuse me, calm down. Andy Cole, would you like to ask a few questions, please? Uh, excuse me, how do you feel about uh, coming to Manchester United? Yeah, what about the money you cost? <laughs> is it true that money's made you fresher than what you already are? <laughs> 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 Thank you. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. you. feel you. get on with the lads? Yes, I do. Except Paul Lynch. Except Paul Lynch. How do you feel about Ryan Giggs when he makes out that he's shy and he's as fresh as anybody else? <laughs> Ryan is. is it? Yeah. Do you feel um? Do you feel you're the best dancer in the club? Without a shadow of a doubt. Yeah, don't you feel confused from shape, yeah? Don't worry about that. Okay. <laughs> don't worry about that. What's doing, mate? Oh. <laughs> Paul Parker's the best man. Who's sorry, mate? Paul Parker. You mean Benny? Yeah, Benny. <laughs> Followed by okay. Pally. Followed by Pally. That's very good, you know. What about a dress sense? Who's the best dresser and who's the worst dresser? Hey, excuse me, Mr Giggs? 
No comment. But Excuse me, mate. Can you? Ah. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> There's a warning. Please do not go near this man. He is highly affected and is very well armed. His name is Bunjabi Bunjaji. And he must be left alone at all reasons. This is a news bulletin. This is a news bulletin. Trevor Wright Donald, ITN. Over to Grange Hill. Here's Fat Al. Fat Al. How was school today? How was Mrs. McClusky? <laughs> would, you, would you like to say anything on my show? Not really, sir. I think most of the players are um, over the disappointment of last weekend. I don't think we'll ever truly get over it, but um, it goes down as a, a close shave for us and uh, everybody give it their all and it on the actual day I believe in fate and I don't think it was meant to be. But we've got a great day to look forward to tomorrow. Let's hope uh, we can produce one of our vintage performances. <laughs> Okay. Oh, oh, okay. 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 Stuart will play right side anyway. Time to go out. Time to go out, yeah. Not that? Yeah.